Is the game supposed to look like that or what? And where the sound at? What's up, y'all? This your man, Step. And welcome back to Three Horror Games. It's been a little minute, you know what I'm saying? But let's get back in this game, in the, in this in this series. The first game is the Bloody Basketball. I don't know if it's supposed to have that pink and green kind of, you know, effect going on. But we're going to rock with it, you know what I'm saying? Maybe that's how the game's supposed to look. I don't know. I hope not. Who out there playing with my ball? Oh, snap. My ball playing with my ball. Whoa. Zoomy. 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 Can I eat an apple? I could. Ooh. I'm going to save that one for later. I'm feeling a little full up on apples. Nah, you're going to turn that off. I mean, on. Uh. Hey, ball. Who told you you could play with yourself? <laughs> Sex joke is not really that funny. So I just got to shoot? Well, I mean, I do play basketball. <laughs> Look at that. I told y'all I play basketball. <laughs> I told y'all I know how to play ball. Now watch. Some old dude gonna be like, man, you're you're pretty damn good. And I'm gonna turn around and it's gonna be a damn demon staring at me. <laughs> Aw. Well, Step, you, you, well, what happened to you being good at basketball? And it's like, hey, man. Somebody fouled me when I shot that. <laughs> Just like then, somebody, I felt some presence. Look at that. How many shots I need to make before I'm done? Because if this going to be a horror game, you need to, I don't know. I must be, I must be at the house by myself. My parents must have left me and they, you know, it was like, hey. I mean, that's pretty damn convenient staying right by a damn basketball court. You know what I'm saying? Look at that. Wait a minute. I made that. Y'all saw me make that. I guess I'm going to bed. I live in a small ass place. And what my front door at? You mean to tell me you ain't got a front door? I, I could have swore. Oh, here you go. I was like, I could have swore I had a front door. Is it time for bed? Is it time for apple? Is it time for whatever the hell that is? Water? I don't know. What's the point of anything in this game? I want to like it. Oh, I can hide. Oh, that's some bullshit. You know what? How about we? And why this ball bouncing forever? I just noticed it was bouncing forever. Three pointer, right out. The, wait a minute. Three point, right out the gate. Oh, I made that. Unless that wasn't number net in a bad way, cause I missed it. We're gonna try again. Three pointer. Let's go. Oh, oh, really? You need a little. I think you need a little get gas in your ball. I think you might need a little gas in that ball. Three point. Oh, that's way off. I'm about to make a three pointer before I go back in the house. Boink. Oh yeah, number net. Yeah, that wasn't nothing but net. That was you hit the backboard. Well, it was nothing but net for me today. How about we turn the power off? You know what? I can't even. Yeah, I can. Cause once you turn that power off, that's it. You just dead. You done your race. You might as well leave it on. It ain't no way you go be able to see without the light on. I mean, at least I can go behind my house. If I couldn't go behind the house I live in, that would have been a real big issue. And I'm dead ass trying to figure out what the hell I gotta do. Cause I'm losing my mind right now. This ball keep, you know what? I'm bringing the ball inside. That's what I'm about to do. You sit your ass on that bed. Yeah, you just sit in the corner and think about what you did. But the bad thing about that is I can't get the ball. So, so that shot ain't count. So maybe you gotta stand like right in the thing, right? Yeah, it count. Maybe you know what? Maybe that's what it was. Maybe I had to, I had to be right in the thing. Cause I'm like, bro. See, it's four points. Not bad. D five. Right out the gate. Anybody watching me? All the girls out there watching me. Shot six. Oh damn! How precise you want me to be? That's seven. How many damn? Oh. Hey, what's up, dude? It's so terrifying. <laughs> Find my basketball. I'm pretty sure my basketball might be behind my house. It's got to be behind my house. Oh, damn. Say it ain't so. Did I murder somebody because I lost the game of one? I'm not going down there. I see my ball. You can keep it. I'm going to be honest with you. You can keep it. You can keep my ball. Oh, oh rip. 
Well, I mean, step, you did say they could keep it. I'm like, bro, I was just playing. You gotta, sometimes you gotta fake it, you know? Sometimes you gotta, sometimes you just gotta, you gotta, you gotta play with people. Ah, so scared. Look at all this blood. Either this kid died or whoever I'm using is grown, man. Either they died. What you doing? Where is you going? And you just, and they just okay with this. They just okay with this. Whoever I'm using, whoever I'm using, I can't even go that way. Whoever I'm using, all right with this. Whoever I'm using, all right with this. I can't go that way. So we got to go back. Well, where you want me to go? And that was unnecessary. It was loud. It was super loud. I hated it because it was so loud. Do they do do people that make games be not understand it? Well, I'm trapped in here forever. Do people not understand that people like me have ears? But if they keep making these loud games that damage our hearing, then we won't be able to play their games again. Do they ever think about that? No, I don't think they do. I really don't think they do. I don't think they think about that sometimes. Sometimes. Eight. Eight what? Nine. Eight, nine what? Is that a birthday hat? Who birthday is it? Eight, nine, six, eight, six, nine? Don't tell me I gotta put them. Oh, I got my ball. I don't know what you want me to do, big dog. But I got my ball and I'm about to get out your house. What's up, boy? <laughs> ah, so scary. You should have gave me a flashlight in this game. Why not have a flashlight? If you know I'm gonna be in the dark, I get it. You trying to be unknown. Oh, it's a maid. No, it ain't a maze. Yeah, if you trying to be unknown, that's cool. But you, people still gotta be able to see what you, you, not only is you trying to make us deaf with your loud music, but you trying to make us blind too. They gonna let me leave? I think so. Yep, they let me leave. But is it that easy? I think so. And what what light is on me? Was that a light on my chest? I'm, I'm gonna just go back in my apartment. Never mind, I can't go back in my apartment. I'm gonna call that an apartment. It's a separate apartment. It's not. It's not. It's too small to be a house, but it's big enough to be an apartment. I guess I'm doomed to play go home. Okay, well, at least you let me go home. I was going to say I'm doomed to play basketball forever. But it's locked. How you expect me to get in here when it's locked? It was eight. Was it? Eight. Six, seven, nine. It would be like, hey, you got to go back in. Eight, six, seven, nine. That wasn't it. It, I, I'm pretty sure the first number was eight. Maybe it's eight. Maybe it's eight, nine, six, seven. Nope. Six, eight, seven, nine. It had to be something. And who would want to stay in here? Look at this. They trashed my place and they put blood all over the place. That's disrespectful. Don't look door. Well, what you talking about? Don't look door. With this paper in my face? See, listen. Jordan, if that's your name, I'm going to tell you straight up, son. Loud doesn't mean scared. All you did was give me a slight headache. You know what I'm saying? That game was bad. It was. First off, it was way too damn dark. It was boring and shit. You know, that was probably their first game, which I understand you got to start somewhere. But it was boring. You know, all you're doing is shooting a basketball seven times, and then always that lights go out. Bloody footsteps stop me from going in my apartment. And then I got to follow this trail like a dumbass. And then all I do is go down there and something, steal my basketball for what? And then I go down there, get a cold, open my, my apartment, which I should have stayed in the whole time. And then I die. It's boring. You know, there's no real, no real beef, no real potatoes, no real substance. You know, it's just a little boring ass, cheaply made horror game. It sucked. And it wasn't scary. It was too damn loud. 
it pissed me off how loud it was. And it was way too damn dark that I mentioned that. That's it, though. That's all we got for the first game. Let's go ahead and get in the second game. The second game is called Enclosure. I don't know what the hell Enclosure means. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I know what the word means, but I don't know what the game means. So let's go ahead and we're going to enclose another bloody dark game. So fun. You got to love these dark ass games. They're at least they ain't got no run or no real survival buttons. It's just E and, and everything else. Now, I think this game might be like PT because I just got in it and it looked like a PT game. So I think this might be a PT kind of game. Deadass might be like BD. I mean, it don't look bad for the style. It don't look bad. It's not dark. It's actually pretty than your radio. I ain't talking about Cuba Gooding Jr. radio. Man, it's sad. I got a headache a little bit off that first game. It was too damn loud. But this ain't about the first game. We playing Enclosure PD. And this is where the PT come in. My only issue with this. Hey, you want to stop crunchy crunchy? Damn trash bag. I told that trash bag. I did. My only issue with this game is if I'm going to be going through this long ass tunnel constantly, different things going to be happening. Y'all done played so many PT style games. At one point, I told myself, and the trash bag on. I told myself at one point, PT was getting stale. What was that black line? Is this a mirage? Y'all know what I'm talking about. You ever just be on the road and it's a hot day and you just see like black stuff on the ground and as you get closer, it disappears. It's a mirage. I mean, you dying straight up. It just means we all dying. Watch some scientist gonna come in the comment section talking shit. I'm gonna be like, bro, you're dying. Just accept it. Now, where's my trash bag? Where my. Radio. The hell is that? Is that white stuff? Damn, that's a lot of cum. That's a lot of cum. Somebody came all over the place. Man, pallet. You was just standing up. Oh my god, is that the haunted ghost? The <laughs> that was whack. Man, bro, come on, bro. You ain't even give me enough time to take it in. That's what she said. That was a good one. That's what she said. Let me get that flashlight. Hey, you finally made it dark, but at least you gave me a flashlight. You gotta respect people who give you a flashlight in these dark games. Don't listen to this. Am I that elderly man? So I'm in that bunker building. Am I the man, am I the old man who died or am I the, old, the man who killed the old man? The old woman, you know, it could have been, a, that's a big ass head. Let's just be real, his head like the size of a, a small watermelon. Let's just be real, that's a big head. Who head is that big? So I'm possessed, is what you're saying. So it's demons. Demons, oh, damn. What's up with your textures? Why you look like, you look like a walking purse. Like straight up, you look like a walking female, a woman purse. Behind you, ah, I'ma just walk this way. What's up, what you wanna talk about? What? I'm expecting it, I suspecting it. You can't kill. You can't. You can't scare me with the. You can't scare me with the cliche behind you thing when I'm already suspecting it. Anything behind me? Nah. I like how you took my one flashlight away. I was getting so comfortable using it, and then you take it. The radio. I don't know what you mean, sir. Well, I tried to go forward, but I couldn't go forward radio. So I guess I got to go back. 
I know what you mean. You can't go back. That's what he said. But it's the only way forward. Might not respect it, but you gotta understand it. Oh my god. Science? I was just talking. I don't know what you're talking about, radio. Radio. Radio, you confusing me, radio. Is it something behind me? Or is it something ahead of me? Or is that radio? Ah, radio! Help me! All these trash bags. So what's in the trash bags? Dead people? Probably dead people. How many people Andrew killed? He just be killing people? Is that what it is? He just be killing random people all the time? Anything, radio? There is no other way, Andrew. Pick up that axe and finish the job. Break the circle. Free yourself from all this. Pick up the axe. Now what you mean? Now what you mean? Pick up the axe. Pick up the axe. Now what you mean? Who I'm killing? Who I gotta kill? Who I gotta kill to get out this nightmare? And who is him? I thought I already killed him. Hey, sir, I'm sorry, only way to escape. Now I'm gonna just leave. Well, I'm sorry, sir, I tried, you saw that. I tried to leave, the first thing I tried was to leave, but I gotta kill you, big dog. I'm sorry, you gotta come in and get it. It's the true ending. It's another ending. I'm not going back to play that game because that shit was pointless, you know what I'm saying? How the hell you gonna put true ending? All I did was just play the game I ain't do I ain't do nothing important. I ain't do nothing special. I did nothing different that anybody else would do. See the thing about these PT games, what made PT special, and I shouldn't be saying this, cause it's already been said a bunch of different times. What made PT special was even though it was slow, it was random at times. It was different and it was claustrophobic. This game was just a big ass tunnel. It was the same thing. No different rooms. I mean, yeah, they had the room with all the damn science things, but it ain't make sense. Why you got these people, these like little experiments in these big tubes? You know what I'm saying? You ain't got nothing dealing with the idea of a PT style game. It's just a big sewer tunnel. This kid, yeah, he killed somebody. They say he was possessed, but why was he possessed? You ain't even had nothing explaining the damn demon that was trying to possess this kid. All it was was you show me a ghost that jump scared me. Well, it ain't scared me, but it jump scared me. You know what I'm saying? Then you got this big thing that looked like a giant woman's purse. And then you come in with this laboratory looking room. And then I come across this man and I kill him. What do it all mean? I don't know. So it was a it was a whack game. I ain't like it. I mean, the only thing I could say that was good is that they gave me a flashlight. I appreciate the flashlight. The last game is called The House. And I think, I think this game going to be kind of like Power Drill Massacre if you ever seen me play that. I, I think I played that. I think I played the Power Drill Massacre game. I know I got it and I'm going to play it again. I played The Nun. It's kind of like that. You know what I'm talking about. That style, that pixelated style with the, the old school Resident Evil camera angles and all that. Oh, I ain't know what the hell is happening. Yeah. The tragic events of that day still intrigue not only the FBI, but the whole country, and it has become one of the most bizarre cases that has never been solved. There are reports of people who say they hear the deafening screams just by going near that place. I like how they give me time to read that. Colorado, 1979. Man, I remember 1979 like it was 1979. I remember that day. I remember it. I remember it. Why does your family have a house here in the middle of nowhere, Scott? I mean, because pe some people like to be away from the city. I think it belonged to my great-grandfather. Damn, John, Scott, what's up with your face? The oldest man bought the house at auction a long time ago. My family never managed to sell it, and it was abandoned for some years. So, now it's mine. Of course they, ugh, of course they didn't. This house is falling apart. How old is it? Relax, bro. The furniture's almost new. I can't believe I left my aerobics class for this. Guys, nobody in my family wants this house. We can do whatever we want here. We could smoke some dubs, some joints. We could 
eat some shrooms, you know, we can have some sex with each other. Nobody will care if we break something, have a party, or even demolish this crap. Okay, okay. You've already convinced me. Ashley and I will go in and have a look around the house like some dumbasses. You ain't never been in the house, but y'all want to go. She, she got the normal face, you know what I'm saying? I'm excited for the day. I've always had a crush on Scott. He just recently broke up with my friend Sarah, so I don't want to be a douchebag. I only came on this trip because Ashley didn't want to. Ah, I see what it is. So you just waited for your time to strike. That's what it was. You got to play your cards right sometimes. You know what I'm saying? I better hurry up and get my backpack out of the van. Oh, I like this. See, the only thing I'm not a fan of when it comes to powder and mask is the idea that I got to run away from some shit. You know what I'm saying? And that's pretty much what it is. I can't open it. Maybe Scott can help me. Hey, Scott, I got a crutch on you. I'm a little horny. Let's do it. I'll check the tires before I park the van near the house. You can go on ahead. I'll check the tires. Yeah, but I got to get my back. Here's your backpack. You can put it in the bedroom on the second floor. Okay, thanks. So, which, the, this way. I'm going to just, yeah. I mean, y'all couldn't park, like, closer to the house? Y'all know I'm going to probably need to run, right? That's usually what happened in these kind of games. Especially knowing I ain't got no stamina. This is the house. My friends in there are probably dead as hell. And Scott know what the deal is. Or maybe Scott don't know what the deal is. Scott probably don't even know it's a man living in his walls. And he's just like, hey, you know, it's my first time. What's that? A bucket? I don't need a bucket. You might need a bucket. I'm just saying. You might need a damn bucket, lady. You might need a bucket. And this house ain't got no windows at all. That's a damn shame. This house ain't got no windows. It's locked. It. I should put my things away first. Yeah, I bet you should. You're not gonna ask where your friends at? Oh, y'all yeah, most definitely gonna need to run. What's up with the newspaper? Mr. Noel Campbell. Two days ago, the 17-year-old boy Noah, Noah, Noah Campbell was hunting with his father when he disappeared in the woods. Today, the police found the boy's blood and a piece of his pants in, the un, in an area known to inhabit Mount Lyons. The boy's body wasn't found at the scene, indicating that the boy managed to escape the attack. You just assume he survived Mountain Lions because you ain't find his body? You do know Mountain Lions know how to eat, right? Come on, bro. They could have dragged that man. I can't even get out of that. How you Escape, that's retarded. Why not E? Why not the button I press to get in it? Hey, dude, with the ugly face, Brian. This place doesn't look so bad. Ashley must be in the bedroom upstairs putting the things away. Wait until y'all got to go in the damn basement. I don't need a light to fight. Yeah, wait until y'all got to go in the basement. Y'all guys going to die. I think Scott did it. Straight up, lock. I think Scott did it. Just put my things. Well, I'm trying to find the room you got to go in. Yep. Hey, what's up, girl? What's up, girlfriend? Now I can put... That's the ugliest backpack i ever seen. Now I can meet everyone downstairs. Yeah. Well, guess we gotta go meet everyone downstairs. What's down here? What's in this room? It's locked. Everything locked. I, you know what I'm thinking. I doubt they gonna make me run because it ain't too many places to check. It's pretty much like, you know, it's just that. Where everybody at? Hey, what's up, girl? This damn tap doesn't work. Can you go outside and ask Scott to fix this crap? I'll do whatever I can, miss. That's the bait. No, that ain't the basement. That's the back. No, it is. No, you know what? I'm going to go through the front door. I'm not going to go in the back. Where everybody at? Oh. I was like, where the hell y'all at? Y'all out here smoking them joints and doobies? There seems to be some problem with the plumbing in the house. The taps don't work. Brian told me. We're going to the next town. Oh, y'all got to go to another town. To buy some drinks and something to eat. I'll call a plumber as soon as I get there. We have y'all ain't got no phones. We have to shake this place up. Well, this is 1979, right? We have to shake the what? What the brick phones, right? The brick phone. Hell, if I know. 19. I'm pretty sure it was probably in the 80s. You know what I'm saying? So they they was one year away from having brick phones. We have to shake this place up. Did you bring a radio? This is a very old house. There must be a radio somewhere. Can you and Ashley look for it while we do the shopping? Sure. Yeah, we'll do we'll do whatever you want. We'll we'll go we'll go in the basement, and check everything. Yep. Just remember we might die though. Where Ashley at? Ashley. Hey, what's up, girl? I will help you, but I don't want to wear out my fingernails messing up. Oh, you one of them pretty ass females, huh? Well, just know if it comes to you surviving, you probably going to die because you don't know how to survive because you too worried about your fingernails. You can put the radio on the table if you find it. 
I really like how you're not trying to help me. I'm not going to lie. I like this game. I mean, ain't nothing really happened, but I like the style. And I like the suspension, suspicion of things happening. Key. Collected key for what? Honorable discharge is to certify that Henry F. Smith Medical Research Department, Army of the U.S. is hereby honorably, honorably discharged from the military service of the U.S. This certificate is what? Wait a minute. So we got, so what? We got some crazy dude living in here? It's just some crazy dude living in here? Oh, damn. I found it. Maybe this will be useful. I got a flashlight. Oh, I like that flashlight. And it's on F. It ain't some obnoxious button. Here's the radio. I better take it downstairs. Please don't die, Ashley. I like you as a character. You seem like you're just trying to get the job done. Hopefully. Well, you're not Ashley. Your name not Ashley. I think Amy, Rebecca, whatever your name is. Hey, Scott, Amy, Amy. I'll help you, but I don't want to. You can put the radio on this table. Oh, I found it. Here you go. It's not working. That's because you need batteries. Seems that the batteries are missing. Oh, damn. Yeah, I found a key. You should have had an inventory. Well, you got an inventory, but you ain't got... You could have showed me the key I got. I'm just saying. You really could have showed me the key I got. It's locked. That's the back. Or is this the back? That's the back. Maybe I got... No. Oh, maybe I could go in the basement. Because I got the key and I got a flashlight. Flashlight. Yep. Oh, no. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Oh, I hate this. Oh, I hate this. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. I, I'm, 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 I'm hoping you survive. I like you as a character. I hate it. 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 With the batteries. I got the batteries. Rebuilding brain tissue seemed crazy at first. I worked with this all my life, and now they discard me like an animal. I served so much time, so many secrets, so many deaths. They forced me to sign a confidentiality document so all my work, my life story stayed in the army. Oh, what you is, some scientist? It's locked. Oh, well. Oh, no, I hate it. Yeah, so you're not going to tell them about the notes you found? Did the power go? Oh, my fucking God, bro. I'm a little dizzy. I must be dehydrated. Oh, let's get some to drink. It's empty. Well, fuck. That looked like the power was going out. Well, I mean, the power in her brain was going out, I guess. So we got the batteries. Let's go do this. Hey, if I faint, just put me up in, just put me in the corner and, and watch me. Wow. It's working now. I asked Ashley if she brought a water bottle. Yeah, because I'm really dehydrated. You would think they'll bring something anyway. Did you bring a water bottle? No, I wouldn't have thought that this dump would ha wouldn't have water. I mean, y'all couldn't have went to the store and got something. I'm not feeling well. I'm a little dizzy. If I know Brian and Scott well, they won't bring anything non-alcoholic to drink. There's a well next to the house. Go there to drink water. If you get worse, we can go to the hospital. I'm sure it's not. Well, how? How are we going to go if they took the only damn car? I'm sure it's nothing serious. I'm going there. Wait, you mean to tell me the well way out here? The well way out here? Why? Why the hell the way, why is way out here? I get it, it's a well, but damn. There must be some bucket around. What, what? Didn't I say she might need a bucket? Oh, wait, I remember where it said it's outside in the shed. My slow ass, I remember. I remember. Now watch, as soon as I grab it, old girl gonna start screaming. Got a bucket. It's not gonna be an easy drink. And shit, who knows, this water in this well might not even be what I need. It's probably, it's probably gonna kill me, or poison her, or drug her, or somebody gonna hit in the back of the head. Wait, you couldn't just, you couldn't just scoop that? You couldn't just scoop that, but, and I found a key. Hmm, I don't think you wanna drink that. Seems there's a thing with a key. Did you drink, though? Did she drink? I'm not sure she drank. And I, I think I know where that key go. How convenient I find the one key. Ooh, music got real moody. I bet this key go downstairs in the basement. You got to get it out the way. Okay, let's do this. I'm going to just sprint for it. So I, well, so much for that. I tried. You saw me do it. It was the first place I checked. You just never know. 
You just never know. Here we go. This place is empty. I expected something more interesting. Well, give it a few seconds. Hey, is that my people? Why they honking? Yo, somebody gonna start chasing my... Who the fuck? Oh, y'all scared me. We're back! Finally, you're here. What took you so long? Y'all might want to watch out for Ashley. I think she might be dead. We had some unforeseen problems. I had to call the plumber who can only come tomorrow morning. He brought the drinks. We brought the drinks. Did you find the radio? Yeah, it was in one of the rooms on the second floor. Right. What are we waiting for? Let's party! Well, mm, he dancing. Well, he dancing. Well, she dancing. What's up, Brian? You like my new dance moves? I mean, it look like you just churning some damn butter. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, if that's what you like. This music is cool. Well, it is the late 70s. Going into the 80s where some of the best music in the world was made. What are you waiting for? Come dance with us, maybe, lads. So, what are we doing? What, we just about to go die? Oh, fuck. What was that? What the hell was that? Hey, did y'all hear that? Yo, so I'm the only one. So we just gonna play like I'm the only one who heard that. All right, I play. I play for a little bit. I play, I play this game. I play. Oh, man. What the fuck? And you just go in it. Oh, crap. This is the other side of that room. The test with the last corpse was almost a success, but it seems that the body didn't last more than 30 seconds. What you making, zombies? Sheriff Campbell always hated me. He was sure that I was involved in the disappearance of that damn boy who was his nephew, which didn't help much. They went through my house and found some experiments with rats in the basement, which was enough to destroy all my work. All my progress has now been absolved by the foundation of the house. It's just a matter of time for me to reach perfection. Unless you working on yourself. Maybe he trying to find, you know, you trying to live forever. After a while, a huge emptiness and depression overwhelmed me. I was lost, but it seems that God guided him for my purposes. For a while, I was confused. He knocked on my door. His leg was bleeding profusely. I thought a bandage in it, but I felt that this visit was, wasn't a mere coincidence. I started cutting his tendons, poor boy. He was screaming without knowing the greatness of his existence. I was so euphoric that slowly his heart stopped, but this event cleared my mind. So you did have something to do with the boy. Now I knew what had to be done. God guided him to me. I couldn't interfere in his destiny. How the hell are you supposed to how the hell are you supposed to sit there and say you know his destiny? I'm taking my ass upstairs. I'm going upstairs. I'm not about to play. <laughs> Whoa, we'll build a fire outside. I'll wait for you there. You're not going to ask me where I was? you just going to jump scare me like a boss? I found a separate room that an old man was staying in. Y'all not suspicious about that? At all. At all. Y'all just cool with it. I like this game. It's real mysterious. What's up, boy? I found a strange room in the basement with some sinister notes. I don't know if I'll have the courage to sleep in this house. No one has lived in this house for decades. If the first owner was a dangerous person, he must be in diapers or has already kicked the bucket. No, nah, because I think he I think he was reaching perfection, and I think to him perfection was living forever, but he might be a damn experiment kind of went wrong. Or he was experimenting on some little boy and turned him into a zombie, so we might want to be careful out here. I'm not sure about this. No imbecile is going to come walking to this house in the middle of nowhere because of his bloodlust. This only happens in the movies. Or in video games, which y'all is in. You is in a video game. Maybe in Los Angeles. Blah, 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 blah. Try to relax a little bit. You must be right. Nah, you girl. See, sometimes you just gotta... Most of the time, you gotta follow your gut. And in this case, I think she should follow her gut. But she let Scott talk out of following her gut. Don't you think you've had too much to drink? But I haven't even finished my first beer yet. This is the tenth time you said this, and you're always holding a different can. Whatever. Scott, my bro... They're... Your prayers are so cool to give you a house. To be honest, my parents didn't give me this house. They're cheapskates. They don't even know we came here. Cool. You're the man, Scott. Yeah, he the man for not telling nobody he was out there. Like a dumbass. Damn it, Scott. Are you serious? I didn't lie when I said that this house is abandoned. My parents don't, don't care. Just relax. The only thing we have to worry about is the eye collector maniac. 
while brutally murdering his victims, he liked to gouge out their eyes while they were still alive to keep as a souvenir. I heard that his favorite victims were women. Besides, this house was the place where he made his last killing. And listen, and you think is is nothing wrong with the fact that I found a random room downstairs in the basement with the TV on and a couple of notes detailing some things. And y'all don't find nothing wrong with that? Is you stupid, my nigga? I've never heard about this. You're making it up. That was a long time ago. Of course you never heard of it. You told me it wasn't dangerous here. I was just trying to calm you down. Shut up, Scott. I need to take my allergy medication. I'm going in. Somebody need to go with this girl. Me too. I'm tired of being around these assholes. Come on. I'm just kidding. Or maybe y'all going to die. I don't know. Either y'all, either the men going to die. Once the men die, y'all done your rings. Because they the muscle. The women there for backup. Boys about to get those poopy in here. You ain't even gonna know what poopy is when it hit. You ain't gonna know. You ain't even gonna know. You won't even know. Drinking on an empty stomach wasn't a good choice. I'll eat something. Me too. I'm not hungry. Well then what are you? Oh, she said a medication. That's what she said. I mean, that's what she said. With a pack pack. So you just took that dry? What you ate the whole backpack? Oh, damn. Look what your damn medicine did to you. It put you in a butthole. A real weird-looking butthole. Somebody might... Well, she died. She died. Holy sh... This medicine makes me a little sleepy. What time is it? Where's Ashley? I don't know. Ashley might be dead. Ashley might be done your reins. I think Ashley might be done your reins. How about we check the hallway? No, lock. How about we check the basement? This game was long as hell, but I like it. Sounds like someone screaming in the basement. Oh no. Oh no. You don't want to go find backup and then go check? You just want to go check? Is you stupid? You must be stupid. You must be that thing they call stupid. You must be dumb. Hey, Ashley. Ashley, I'm in the basement, not seeing a, not seeing a girl. In the stove. Yo. Oh my God, what the fuck is happening here? I don't even know. Oh damn, she hanging. Holy crap. Yeah, we need to go upstairs. We need to find the, we need to find the boys. We need to find the boys. They probably dead too. It's locked. I need to find another way out. Like what? The back? Oh. Oh, shit. Stay away from me. Ha, 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 ha. Scott, are you the maniac eye collector? What? No. It doesn't even exist. I was just making fun of you. The only person who died in this house was my great grandfather. He died the first day he came here, but he was old and died of a heart attack. He was old and died of a heart attack. Ashley ran out to the basement. I thought you would be braver. Are you fucking kidding me? I saw a fucking body in the basement, Scott. Are you trying to scare me too? Well, you can go down there if you want to. I'm serious. Shit, she might have tripped on the stick. She might have tripped. Her body was on the fucking ceiling. What? You're trying to play a trick on me. You want to go? You want to go, bruv? I'm fucking serious. What's your problem? Okay, let's check it out. Yeah, let's. Oh, you beat me to it? Oh, well. So much for Scott. So much for Scott. I can't even go out that way. So what they want me to do? I can't even check, what, upstairs? This way? It's locked, I need to find them. I'm guessing we gotta go upstairs. Go up the stairs, girl. Go up the stairs, it's so retarded sometimes. How about the window? I would have did the window if I was you. Straight up would have did the window. The hell is that? What's this? The hell? Oh my god, what the fuck is that? Brian? What has this thing done to you? Cup. Bleed. The hell are you, a fucking parasite? No. I'm more. I need to get out of this place now. 
I don't think that's gonna happen, baby girl. You can try, but I don't think that's gonna happen. What the hell? Oh, fuck. Go in the door. The window. My first idea the first time. Yeah, do some Leon, Scott, Kennedon, RE4 type nonsense. You might get hurt. So you should have tucked and rolled. I think you went face first and kind of just thought you was landing in some water or something like that. But she, she, you know. You ain't got the key. Oh, damn. Well, so much for that. I guess you just got to run for it. Holy fucking Jesus. Oh, damn, the house alive. Yeah, you might just want to go for it, baby girl. Yeah. Oh, man, that house about to eat you. Oh, my God, the house about to eat you. Who is that? Wait a minute, was you expecting me? How convenient. Wow, that was convenient. Must be the Ghostbusters, I don't know. You mean to tell me? Okay, I got something to say about that game. Listen, not a bad game. I like that. My issue though was the ending. You just turned it into some, it was like that, it was like Monster House, you know what I'm saying? I think that's the name of that movie. Yeah, Monster House, that, that animated movie that came out back in 06. You know what I'm saying? Where the kids was trick-or-treating and then the monster house was just eating up people and stuff like that and then it came alive. It was just like that. I think that was a cop-out. You feel me? I mean, I know it's called The House, but they could have did so much better with that. This dude turned himself into the house by eating people and doing experiments on himself and other people, but it was kind of retarded. I think what they should have did was just have a killer. It's like when dudes started running after me, I thought that was it. Like I was getting killed, Put in the basement and experiment and all. I think that was just a real bad cop out. The game itself was good. The music was nice. The animations was cool. The controls was kind of all over the place with turning. I think it did drag on just a little bit, but it was cool. You know, I just think having the house come alive. And then who the hell was that that just pulled up out of nowhere and 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 picked me up? You mean to tell me they just so happened to see the big giant house and they just stopped for me? They ain't even know I was running. So I, that's why I think it was a cop-out. You know, you could have had me go to the road and shit. Like, I don't know. It was just, it, 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 out of all these games, the best game, without a doubt. But that was three horror games. Hope y'all had a good time watching me play these games. Let me know what your favorite game was. If it ain't the house, you tripping. Straight up. But if y'all want to try to eat these games, I might leave a link for all of them. Probably not. But let me know your thoughts and opinions. And thanks. Oh, yeah, and if you want to see the three horror games playlist, I'll drop a link for that. And thanks for watching.